University of Georgia Extension was officially founded in 1914 through the Smith-Lever Act, a federal law that established and funded a state-by-state -state national network of educators who bring university-based research and practical knowledge to the public. The Cooperative Extension Service, as it was called, was based in agricultural and home demonstration work, helping farmers, homemakers, and young people with their daily lives. Through the years, extension projects may have changed, but the core goals haven't. Today, UGA Extension remains committed to providing unbiased, research-based information in the areas of agriculture, the environment, families, food, health, lawn and garden, and youth. Through a well-organized network of specialists, agents, and staff covering each county across the state, information is delivered both online and in person in the form of classes, workshops, programs, events, publications, and more. These educational resources are tailored to meet the needs of individual counties and communities. UGA Extension helps drive Georgia's agricultural sector, a main economic engine and source of employment, by assisting producers in farm and business management, field crops, integrated pest management, urban agriculture, and more. Each scientist has different research projects and it really helps us to learn what they're learning. We have the best extension service that I know of anywhere, and our research arm is also really great. Typical day for me, uh, we're standing in some applied research trials, examining some of our most common pests, trying to come up with better methods of management. Our objective, though, is just to provide information, research-based information, that's going to allow our producers to make good decisions. UGA Extension also works with schools on programs like Farm to School Workshops, School Gardens, and Career Days. Today we're having third grade Act Day, and this is an opportunity for all of the third graders in our county to come out and to see uh, the agricultural commodities that we have here in Oconee County. These young people can ask questions, you know, what do we get this from? What are we doing with this? How do we get that? It, it's important. It matters. And one day they could possibly have a career in agriculture. Georgia's rapid growth and the diverse ecosystems present both challenges and opportunities concerning the environment. UGA Extension helps increase awareness and appreciation of the state's environmental assets and ongoing efforts to protect these resources by offering expertise in topics like alternative energy, invasive species, pollution prevention, and soil and water conservation. This demonstration or research that we're looking at is using solar power um, to, for cattle watering systems, but we can also do small irrigation systems. We actually disseminate a lot of information through field days, through um, demonstrations like this. We've got four or five of these sites around the state, so we will hold a field day at those demonstration sites. UGA Extension provides resources for parents and families to help with decision making and creating healthy environments. Family and consumer science agents give direction in areas such as childcare, financial literacy and planning, nutrition, healthcare, home businesses, sustainable living, home and vehicle safety, and more. UGA Extension coordinates Walk Georgia, a statewide physical activity program that encourages participants to log exercise hours while learning facts about the state. More than 40,000 people have participated in Walk Georgia, logging more than 4 million miles worth of physical activity. UGA Extension also helps consumers and businesses when it comes to food-related topics. Family and consumer science agents help consumers make confident and informed food selection decisions by considering information such as nutrition and food costs. They also administer safe food handling, preparation, serving, and preserving guidelines to help prevent foodborne illness. I work with um, consumers and with farmers and market managers and other people throughout the state of Georgia, teaching them how to handle food safely. UGA Cooperative Extension helps farmers to grow local markets. We help farmers know how to handle food safely and get it into the marketplace. It's not about selling a product. It's about actually making sure that people are healthy and safe. 
Extension food preservation programs today, which are popular and being conducted actually all over the country, consist of teaching people safe and high quality ways to mainly can, dehydrate, freeze, make jams and jellies, and pickle foods. Our agents in Georgia for the past few years have been um, offering more and more hands-on workshops for people that are wanting to learn to preserve food at home. We deliver Serve Safe training, um, usually through two-day workshops for manager training in Georgia. I know several instances where our people have said, because I already had Serve Safe certification, they hired me over somebody else. Georgia's agreeable climate means that residents of the state have ample opportunities to exercise their green thumbs. Whether it's lush lawns or riots of flowers, fruit trees and shrubs, home gardeners in the state have many options for beautifying their landscapes. As the number of urban gardeners increases, so do the number of phone calls and emails to UGA Extension offices asking for advice on everything from controlling pests to selecting plant varieties. To help agents answer these questions, volunteers are trained in backyard gardening through the Georgia Master Gardener Extension Volunteer Program. We have a lot of people who use our services with uh, uh, getting their soil tested, weed samples or uh, insects for identification. We'll have farmers call in with uh, different questions that range from weed control and pastures, you know, horse management. So it's always something interesting to work with. In the early years, extension agents led tomato clubs for girls and corn clubs for boys. Today, UGA Extension coordinates the state's largest youth development program, Georgia 4-H. The program assists youth in acquiring knowledge, developing life skills, and forming attitudes that will enable them to become self-directing, productive, and contributing members of society. Each year, more than 184,000 students participate at the local level in school and county club meetings led by county 4-H agents and on the state level through summer camps and conferences held at 4-H centers such as Rock Eagle, the world's largest 4-H center. In the past few years, there's been a study that's come out, the Tough study. Those students that participate in the 4-H program, it showed that they are more likely to participate in their community and make an improvement within their community. They're more likely to make healthy decisions and they are more likely to do better in school. We have healthy lifestyle projects, we have science projects, we have workforce projects, and then we even have the agriculture projects. Mastery, belonging, generosity, and independence. Those elements are what are being instilled in the young people that participate in those programs. I enjoy being State 4-H president and being on junior and senior board and leading up to that moment of being on state board and um, just getting to experience so many wonderful things that I would not have been able to experience if I had not been in 4-H. I think that's probably the biggest thing that 4-H gave me was just me seeing the power that somebody can have over someone's life. Georgia 4-H has served over one million participants through the Georgia 4-H Environmental Education Program, a variety of field study experiences for K-12 students, which has brought learning to the outdoors since 1979. Well, I could teach about this in the classroom all day long, but when the kids actually get to get out and get their hands on the activities and participate in stream ecology, they're just experiences that they will always remember. And these are the highlights of our whole school year. They will always remember. We take children to Jekyll Island and they've never seen the ocean before. I wish all the kids in the state of Georgia got to participate in it because it's a fabulous experience. Kids can learn all about the environment, to learn about things that maybe they don't get involved in uh, or get to see uh, in just their day-to-day -day lives or in a classroom. And um, learning to be away from home and they have to show some responsibility, be a little more independent. They get an opportunity to learn things that we're making available to them through curriculum that is based on the research that is done in the other parts of the college. The men and women of UGA Extension improve lives, build economies, and protect the state's precious natural resources by providing practical solutions to an ever-changing modern society. UGA Extension celebrates its rich 100-year history of changing lives and looks forward to what lies ahead. For more information, contact your local UGA Extension office at 1-800-ASK-UGA-1 or visit extension.uga.edu.